Hey everybody, this is Rhino, and we're back to Resident Evil 5. We are fighting Wesker in a way that I had completely forgotten we even fight him. So, it's going to be weird. We've got to get him distracted, either through flash grenades or acid grenades. I'm, I'm going to try the acid grenades first. And then let Sheva shoot a rocket launcher at, the, at him. And then he's going to grab the rocket launcher... And then I think I have to shoot it to make it explode. He'll grab the fired uh, rocket. No point in hiding. Hmm. Where is he? Chris, I need you to distract him. Hmm. That didn't work. Is that all you have? I think we probably need to we probably need to try a different strategy then. Neither one of those things worked. Well, at all. So we need the partner over here so we can put the part So, yeah, nothing is, nothing is helping. Alright, this is another fight where we're going to die. Uh, this is not going to work. So flash grenades don't work, okay? and other things don't work. So I was right about grabbing the thing. So I think what we've got to do is survive. And the odds of surviving are pretty low. You're merely postponing the inevitable. Found you. Hmm. Let's see. Are we Turning off the lights really necessary. Do you have a rocket for me? Your struggle is over. And so he's moved and decided to throw missiles at me. And that's killed me. Alright, we've got this. We've figured it out what we need to do. 
Now, this gun will do 2400 damage. Where I have no clue how much the acid bullets are gonna would do. The flash grenades are useless. Um, so incendiary grenades instead. And we'll try this again. So they want you to start here and grab this and then run I imagine to somewhere where it's dark and pull the lever if we take it back to the dark, we might actually hit there's them. no point in hiding there we go Let's just unload on him as much as possible. And go get some more. Go get some more rockets, which are way up here. And hope this works. This is another example of the game being a little too hard on normal mode. I'll get the rocket launcher. Let's see. Chris, I need a warhead. Come on, load. Watch out. Let's go. Like she's got the rocket launcher. Come on, load, load, load. Hmm. And he's killing me. Then let's combine this with this and try this. Let's move. Let's move some of these things around. And try that again. I'll see you dead. Notice that he shot immediately that time. You definitely want to get this first hit in. If you miss that, you might as well start over. We might actually hit him. Like, apparently he saw me. Though, so... Let's run this way. I'm hoping she's getting the rocket launcher. And then meet me over here. She's like getting killed. And he's not anywhere close. Where are you? Come on, Come over here so I can load. How did she get a rocket in a rocket launcher? Hit it. And 
trying to get that counter attack is no good. Like, I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Now, see when he says that, that's when he starts to throw things at us. Your struggle is over. And. And I can't shoot the missiles in any way. I have no clue what she's doing. Like where... Yeah, let's turn on the menu and, and see where she is and what she's trying to do. So where is he? Where is he? Uh. So we've got the darkness in our advantage. We're ready to go there. I guess... Handgun ammo not gonna be very helpful. Is that all you have? Let me clarify something for you, Rex. I don't think of myself as a king. Hmm. Oh, great. No. I am a god. And even kings bow to god. Like he's just picking up the missiles one handed. So there is a warhead in the box. Let's see if we can find her. Where is she? Ready? Can you hit him? Do you have the rocket launcher? There's no point in hiding. Hmm. Thanks, partner. Hmm. Are you going to hit him? Hit him. Hit him! She, she seems to kind of know when to hit and when not to hit. Maybe I needed to do that. Um, I don't feel like there's any more lights coming on. So. Like, he comes over and kicks that. And... Trying to hit the cryogenic things and see if they will work on them. Suppose right now it's it's just but just exhausting him. Help! 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 Let's 
see. Can we keep him distracted? Trying really hard to you can't hide forever. There you go, get him. Hit him. Does she just not have a rocket in it? That's the problem. Alright. And this is very Nintendo-y. It doesn't feel like I could win in any other way other than the the way they want you to win. Um, we're out. We are out of rockets. She used them all. So, unless there's a, another one in a box. I have no reason to even have this. I guess we're gonna have to get the light out and uh, I think I guess we're gonna have to knock the, the light out and just hit him with the magnum. Uh, I was hoping that he wouldn't be able to hit me. Hmm. While we're at it, why don't we have Sheva go hardcore on him? Ready and fire. Come on, let me hit him. Ah, I got nothing. So now we're we're at a point where we just uh, I imagine I uh, am trying to uh, we're we're probably trying to just wear down his health. And run out of bullets. Like, we are so close. Hmm. I'm trying to figure out what the pattern here is. Hmm. And we can't just hit him with the... Oh, I can't believe we, we still have some health. Hmm. Hmm. I'm just trying to run out of bullets now. I'm hoping that that determines the game to take pity on me. Hmm. 
Okay, let's try this again. Organize, give this to this, um, combine this with this, remove this. That's not gonna work. Give this to him, give this to her. Hmm. And suppose shotgun might also work. Third attempt on Wesker. Third attempt. So I want this to start with. And if he sees me, I don't wanna I don't wanna activate things. Well I might activate things anyways. Like he can see me There's right no now. Has it never occurred to you hmm. that this planet is overpopulated? Only a handful of humans truly matter. Everyone. There we go. Let's see, where are you? you? Coming up here? That's not a good place to be. This is not a good place to be. Hoping she doesn't waste the warhead, and we can come down here and turn off the light and. So I'll try and take him out and do some more damage to him. Notice that the comments are uh, are going a little bit faster this time. Wasn't fast enough. Only those with superior DNA will be chosen by Uroboros. Only them. There we go. So while she's getting a rocket, I'm trying to. Run around this central point so he can't see me. Third time's the charm, hopefully. Him. 
Inject. And good thing you only do, had to do that once. Because if I had to do that three times, I don't think I'd succeed. There's not enough rocket launchers. Did it work? I think so. Hmm. Of course, this is only going to make a him worse and turn into a monster. It'll just take away his ability to think straight. Which might be an advantage, but might not. Does he... I guess he might have multiple viruses in a delicate balance in his body. Hmm. Now, I've been holding on to a rocket launcher for this whole game for this next final boss fight. It's going to be kind of ironic if I didn't actually need it. But I think that's the point in Resident Evil games is you do somewhere around the middle if you're playing well and find it find a rocket launcher and then it makes the final boss fight super easy which will be sort of disappointing but I mean only if I actually succeed I have been playing this game as someone who's played it multiple times and not as somebody who's played it for the first time I can't really go back and completely erase my memories of this game even though I don't remember a lot of this save it Wesker there's no one left to help you now hmm. I don't need anyone else hmm. I have Ouroboros in less than five minutes we'll reach the optimal altitude for missile deployment hmm. he was making a lot of missiles to shoot only a few from one ship. Hmm. I don't know why he was making so many if he only needed like six or so. Resident Evil 5 did a really good job of matching the abilities of the bad guy in the cutscenes to what he can actually do in the game. Like, usually there's... the bad guys look way cooler in the cutscenes than they actually are. So, this isn't just a cutscene, it's got quick time events. I probably would have preferred to just watch it. The blood is interesting. I'm now controlling Sheva. Uh, I guess the other player would have had to put, done that. So we inject him a second time in the cutscene. This is so much a movie. You really wouldn't see a scene like this in a game uh, in most instances. Kick him. So Sheva's gonna let go and bravely sacrifice herself. And Chris can't take it because he's already felt like he lost Jill even though he saved Jill. So I had a quick time event to save him there. Of course you get into this ridiculous final fight in a volcano. No quick time event for that. Where would you find a volcano that is off the coast of an African country? Hmm. 
unless the time frame changed and they flew many, many thousands of miles, it's it's very questionable <laughs> where this could be. And we're saving right now, and that means we should restart right now and organize. So at the end of the day, we didn't need to use that. And if I'm going to use anything, it's probably going to be this. So we'll keep that there and remove that. And ideally, I'm going to play a little bit just to make sure. But. We should be good. I don't have any bullets for this gun, so I might as well just remove it. Uh, silly, but the way things are going. Mm -hmm. And we didn't get any treasures to sell, so upgrading anything we don't have any money for. And we've gone 30 minutes, so... It is very possible that, uh, in fact, let's just move this over here, uh, that it will only take us five minutes or so to beat the final boss and go through the credits. Uh, but there's so much other game to play. There's two other DLCs that I'm not sure I ever played. I'm pretty sure I didn't. There's potentially argument to, to play the game a second time through I wouldn't want to do that in this series it's probably uh, by the time we're done with the DLC it would be a great time to take a break give it a year and come back later anyways that's it for this recording as always I ask you to like share subscribe comment and watch every second of my videos if you want a friend to follow me on basically any social media sites there's a whole bunch of links down below Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.